None of these ads that you see right here are made by real professionals. Instead, I made this by just entering a URL into this website and by telling it that I want Christmas style ads. Also, these creator style UGC ads you see here are not real either. I made these in two minutes using AI. But let's be honest, not all of these AI ad generators are this good. And because I'm obsessed with AI, I spent weeks of my time and thousands of dollars trying out all these different AI ad generators just to save your time. So in this video, I will show you the only two AI ad generators you will ever need. So first, let me introduce you to Holo AI. This AI ad generator turns your website URL into ready to use advertisements in minutes. If you want to try it, by the way, there is a link in the description and I have also arranged you a special discount that you can use with my code. Alrighty, so let me show you how to start using Holo AI. Now all you literally need to do is just click login, just click here and click new brand. Then as the first step, you need to tell the AI what is your website URL. And I'm going to use bloom.com as an example. So let's say that we're, for example, creating content and marketing materials for this brand. Then let's hit continue. Then tell your business name and what you're selling. So bloom.com and products. And then let's hit continue. And here the AI has fetched all the colors and information from the website, which in this case is bloom.com. Let's click continue. Then on this page, you're just going to need to check if the AI got your products right. So it has automatically gathered the products from your website, which is pretty incredible. As you can see, we have all the images and the names and everything. And there's just one issue where it says invalid, no images. So let's just remove that product. And now is the fun part. So now that the AI knows your brand and everything, it is time to create the first piece of content. And to do this, you need to choose the templates that meet your eye. So I like these very simple ones and basic ones. So we're going to choose some of these from the list and it allows you to choose only five. So once you have done that, hit continue. And once again, it will take a minute or two to render your first advertisements. And once that's done, you get to choose which ones you like in this Tinder style. So I like this one. This one's really cool. This one's simple and cool, really nice. This has too much going on to my liking. Here the text is a bit off. This is good. There's a bit of too much text, but it's still good. This one's really nice, really nice, really, really nice. And a bit off. I would say this one's nice as well. This looks good to me. And there's too much going on in this one. And I'll just press hold for a second and the AI will take you to the dashboard. So here are all the advertisements we just accepted. Now you can just basically download these if you wish to. But what's making this stand out from the other competitors is that you can also edit these advertisements. So just an example, let's turn this background into red. So here on the right hand side, you can type in anything. So let's type in turn the background red and let's hit send. And there we go. So it is the exact same advertisement, but this time the background is red. Let's try to do another edit. So let's make it more Christmas like. So let's say give it a Christmas vibe and let's hit send. And there we have it. I mean, isn't that incredible? And as you can see, all the text and everything is in place. So this looks exactly like a real advertisement. And speaking of text, it sometimes so happens that the smaller the text is in the products, the AI might start to add some quirkinesses into it. So for example, here in the Daydreamer package, you can already see that the A and Y letter are a bit off or the text starts to look like it has been generated by AI. But to be really honest, that is nitpicking because people that see an advertisement like this, they are not going to look at it for like 20 seconds or 30 seconds. They're just going to click through or reject. And then if you have an advertisement that you like, for example, this one, just click variate. And now you get to create up to five different variations in this advertisement style. So for example, let's tell it to make it more urgent and let's click generate five variations. And here are the ad variations. So here's the number one, the number two, the number three, the number four, and the number five. I mean, this is so incredible. So I literally Thus far, I have just let the AI know my website name. And with a couple of clicks of a button, I have had these types of advertisements 
created for me, which is mind blowing. But now let's not forget that this is an AI tool and with AI come all these common issues. For example, I'm going to do another round of edits, but this time on this other advertisement, just to show you that it can sometimes go wrong. So for example, here's an advertisement that I otherwise like, but I think that there's way too much text going on. So I'm going to say, cut the text in half. There's way too much text going on right now. And let's see what happens. And here we go. I actually did this a couple of times. Well, as the first attempt, there is no change in anything, basically. So it is the exact same advertisement, the exact same text, and it just made it like an inch taller for some random reason. But then here in the third one, we actually start to see that the AI tried to remove the text from here, but all it did was just make absolutely no sense of it. So definitely the AI does not always nail the edits. And then let's move on to the video advertisements. Head over to this content library, then click videos, tap new to create, and then here are your options. And don't let this deceive you, this AI scenes and this AI ad movie, these are both coming soon. But you still have the image to video and AI UGC style advertisement. So this is super awesome. And this AI UGC trend is massive right now. But I think that the best results are from this image to video section. So just click there and then choose one of your existing designs. And I think that the simpler the design, the better the video output is. So we can try it, for example, with this one. So let's choose this photo we created earlier for social media and let's click continue and let's tell it to make it eye catching and let's click continue again. And this starts to render the advertisement. Here's what the result actually looks like. So here it's rendered like in a Facebook style advertisement. And perhaps the only issue here is that this video looks otherwise super cool, but this green smoke or this stuff over there is pretty random. And unfortunately, right now the video edits are still not available. So if you get a result like this, you just have to regenerate the video. And by the way, now the second video just completed generating. So here you can see what that looks like. So as you can see here, there is no longer that random green smoke. Well, there's still something going on in the background. It looks way more natural and fitting to the context of this advertisement compared to the previous one. So this is how it basically works. So you need to always do a couple of generations and creations if you don't start to see good results. Then let us move on to the second video advertisement type we have on Holo AI, and that is the AI UGC advertisement. So the idea here is to produce these advertisement that don't look like an advertisement. So it is much more like a relatable, authentic product recommendation advertisement. So let's click on AI UGC. Let's choose product in hand. And right now the half screen option is still coming soon. So we need to just use this full screen one. Then you get to choose from one of these actors. And once again, because this is a UGC style advertisement, you want to make it look very authentic and relatable. So just an example, let's choose Ruby over here and let's click continue. Then let's pick the product that I want my avatar to show and let's click continue and let's do add for Christmas. And then remember to choose the voice so we can do, for example, Rachel and we can show subtitles and let's hit generate. And after about five minutes, here we go. Discover bloom.com this Christmas, empowering your natural beauty with clean, cruelty-free skincare. Feel radiant today. I'm not gonna lie, that is just terrible. So the person is not even holding the right product. So this is some kind of a soft drink or some kind of juice, right? And she's talking about skin products. So this is just completely off. And you can try to regenerate it a couple of times, but don't get frustrated if they don't nail this one. I've had very bad experiences with the UGC style ads on Holo AI. So perhaps that's the only issue I really have with the platform other than the small issues with the edits of the images as well. Overall, this is a super powerful platform. As you can see, I did all of this with just a couple of clicks of a button and by telling the AI what my website is. And that's literally it. But now, as you can see, Holo AI is a wonderful AI ad generator but it definitely still falls short in these UGC style advertisements. And this brings me to the second tool on the video today, 
which is called Arc Ads. This tool is the best AI UGC style advertisement generator that I have ever tested. You will also find a link to it and the best deal in the description of the video. So to start using Arc Ads AI, just head over to this web page and click create your AI ad and it will open up a prompt box that looks very similar to ChatGPT. So this is essentially like ChatGPT, but for creating ads. And now if you want to create those super realistic looking creator style UGC ads, just select the video option over here and then literally tell the AI what kind of a video you want to create. So just as an example, I have typed in something like a bird watcher recording a vlog with a selfie stick showing the new thermal camera and talking about how good it is at finding birds and how comfortable it feels to use. And now you can already hit send, but what you can also do is you can input an image of the product you want the actor to use. So just click on here and select your photo and now hit send. Hey folks, just got my hands on this new thermal camera and I had to show it off. Look at this little thing. Fits right in the palm of my hand, weighs almost nothing, and the buttons are right where your fingers want them. I was out here at sunrise and it picked up a flock of finches that I would have totally missed in the shadows. Now this thermal camera shot is just amazing. He is holding it just like you're supposed to, and also when he checks the bird from the view, it looks exactly as it would in the real life. And the reason why I actually made this video is because I have used thermal cameras like this, and I think that it is pretty niche use case. And the AI still absolutely nailed it. So this looks like it was filmed in the real world, which is just awesome. Now let me show you how powerful this is in different types of advertisements. So as the next one, I want to show you how it looks like when you're promoting some skincare product. So for example, here I'm telling the AI, a Gen Z woman films her nighttime skincare routine in her bathroom mirror using a gentle body lotion. She speaks directly to the camera about how it's helped her skin stay hydrated. Dim warm lighting with a calm, quiet mood. She wears a simple headband and soft pajamas. And here's the reference photo. I will make it a bit bigger. So I want the actor to showcase this product in her video. Let's hit generate to see what happens. And this is my go-to body lotion lately. It's fragrance free and crazy gentle. After I wash up, my skin can feel a little tight, especially now that it's getting colder. A thin layer of this keeps everything soft and hydrated all night. Then the skincare routine looks super awesome. And although I must admit that I'm not on platforms like Instagram or TikTok, but I can imagine this is exactly the style that is working right now. So it looks like a real skincare routine before going to the bed and the creator looks authentic and honest, not like it was filmed in a studio and not like it was scripted. And then next up, let me show you how I created an advertisement of this smartwatch held by a Gen Z guy. So here's the input that I gave to the AI. A Gen Z guy enthusiastically talks about the black lead fitness watch using the reference image as he speaks. The background shifts naturally from the roof to the basement, then to his bedroom and other spots. The camera smoothly fo follows him as he moves. And now let's hit generate to see what happens. I'm wearing this thing all week, and it's been pretty solid. The screen's bright, easy to swipe around, and the crown feels nice to click. It keeps up with steps, heart rate, sleep, even reminds me when I've been sitting too long. A quick swipe gives me weather, music, stopwatch, pretty much everything I- Then the smartwatch advertisement turned out amazing. I mean, look at the guy. If you take a look at him, he's actually, he feels like he's a bit awkward in front of the camera. He's looking away, not looking too much to the camera, and he's clearly like taking one shot or two shot, and that's it. So he's not planning this, and he's not scripting this one either, which makes it look super authentic and natural, which is exactly the style we went for. And notice how also these scenes change, and the smartwatch stays in the plain sight all the time, which is exactly what I asked. Then next up, let's do something entirely different. So in the previous ones, I used these images to begin with, but now I want to create something out of thin air. So let's see how well the AI handles this one. So this time I'm creating a completely different type of an ad of an imaginary product. So here I'm telling the AI that a young woman films a fun morning routine with her golden retriever, showing off a new automatic pet feeder. Scene one, she pours kibble into the device and sets the timer while the dog waits excitedly. Scene two, cuts the feeder, dispensing food. Now let's hit generate to see what happens. There it goes, you're so ready for it. This feeder has been a lifesaver on busy mornings. I just set it the night before and he still gets his breakfast right on time while I get ready. 
So now you know exactly how to create advertisements using AI. So if you have a website with a bunch of products on it, just start with Holo AI. Just enter your URL into the system and it will create you these fantastic pieces of content. And you can create videos and images, social media posts, even emails. And also you can try these UGC ads and those usually fail. So that brings me to the next tool, which is the ARC ads where you can create these creator style UGC ads based on simple inputs that literally just describe the scene as if you were talking to a real human. And these are just awesome. So these tools, that is Arc Ads and Holo AI are the only AI ad generators you need. And the funny part is how these complement one another. So if there's something you can't do using Arc Ads, you can definitely do it with Holo. And if there's something you can't do with Holo, you can definitely do it with Arc Ads. And also there are lots of cool features that I didn't have time to go through in this video. So make sure to check those platforms out and you'll find the best deals in the description of the video.